Hello, my beautiful Aries. Welcome to your love forecast horoscope. What is their true intentions towards you? So we're gonna examine what does your love uh, connection, if you're a single couple or anyone in between or anyone who needs love messages, what is this person's true intentions toward you for the long term for the, uh, the connection, the love connection? So what do they want from this love connection? And so guys, thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing, and thank you to my members. I really appreciate all of your support. And guys, you can get a personal read with me at jenniferwalkerzen.com or check out the description box below. And if you like it this way, you want me to continue to do this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. You can do both. Let's start right in. All right, so what is Aries' love interest? The one they're here for, the one they want to know about. What is Aries' love interest? True intentions towards Aries. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. All right, so we got the Ten of Wands so far. So I feel like this person is definitely, you're weighing heavy on their mind here with the Ten of Wands energy. It's like they want to take the burden, the responsibility, and uh, the connection. They're ready for a sense of accomplishment, a sense of completion in this connection. Yep, there we go. They're waiting for the best time, the best opportunity here with the Three of Wands energy. By the way, you guys, also you guys can check your moon, your rising, and your sun sign for more information. Interesting. So it looks like they also, guys, they also, um, their intentions are potentially passionate in nature as well. It's like they want to reach out and flirt with you with the Page of Wands energy. Let's do some more clarifications here as we go further. Aries love interest, the one they're here for, the one they want to know about. Aries love interest. What is Aries love interest true intentions towards them? Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. So let's see, go further here. We have the garden card energy. We have the clover card energy. And we have a person card coming out. So garden card tells me that this person wants to go out um, they really want to take a risk on this situation. Now the person card could be you, could be the love interest, okay? Because the page of wands could be Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. Okay, so let's keep going. Oh, wow. So going further with this person, four of wands energy, nine of wands energy, page of pentacles energy. So this person is definitely looking for something a little bit more serious here with the Four of Wands energy. Uh, Four of Wands can represent a stable relationship. It can represent um, someone close to home. This person is a little bit defensive about getting hurt, but they do want to receive some kind of good news or they want to send you some kind of good news about a potential long-term commitment here. So let's keep going. Star card. And the sun card energy. And the person card. Yeah, this person is really hopeful here. They're really hopeful and they do feel like you fulfill their dreams, their desires. Their intentions are very good here. And they really want to be happy in this connection and they want to reveal some things to you about a potential long-term commitment here. Going further, let's, uh, let's get more information and then we'll do another layer. This Aries love interest. The one they're here for, the one they want to know about. This Aries love interest, true intentions towards Aries. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Yep. There we go. They want to go out. They want to take the burden, the responsibility. They really do have these romantic feelings for you. They may be concerned about you with an ex-partner or they may can be concerned about another person involved with the connection, which could cause some kind of challenges in the connection. This person is trying to be patient to kind of see how things are going to play out here, but they're hopeful that they can have a long-term situation here with the Four of Wands energy. 
see this person wants things to turn in their favor. They really want luck to be on their side and things to align in their favor when it comes to you and them. This person's intentions is a soulmate connection, a relationship here. So continuing to go further here on this. Six of Swords energy, Emperor card energy, Page of Cups. Yeah, this person definitely wants to overcome uh, any uh, challenges here with the Six of Swords energy. Uh, they're looking to the future here and they are wanting to overcome things that have been holding them back when it comes to this connection. And they, they're looking to the, you know, they want to look to the future and see the light at the end of the tunnel here. This person really wants to make a power move towards you, okay, with this Emperor card energy coming out. And they uh, are looking for love. They want love here. Their intentions is love and romance here with the Page of Cups energy. And going further on this, Lily's is saying a long time, commitment, movement or change. Yes, they, they do miss you. They long for you. And they want some changes here. They want some changes in the connection. They are confused because they want a commitment here. And they want something of value here with the money card coming out. So we can see that this person, your person, feels that they have romantic feelings for you. And they're trying to be patient here to see how things are going to play out. And they're a bit confused because they're, they're not sure if there's an ex-partner involved with the situation or another person's involved with the situation. And so they're hoping that things can align in their favor because they do want a commitment here, okay, with the ring card energy. They have a sense that they can overcome these challenges because of relationship and they have a sense that there is something of value here with the money card energy. So going down another layer here. So they want to uh, go out or they have concerned about um, the fact there could be other people involved in the situation. They're trying to be hopeful about this and being patient and making the best decision. It seems like they're concerned about a reconciliation for some of you with the Clover card energy or taking a risk because they don't know if there's other people involved. They want to reveal some things about the fact that they are concerned about getting hurt. They want to take a power move here, Emperor, uh, because they would like some kind of commitment here with the ring card energy coming out here. We see that there is a person here and another person here and some kind of movement, travel, or change or this longing energy for you, okay, with the, with the ship card energy coming out here. Going further. It looks to me like there seems to be this, they're, they're weighing very heavy on them with the Ten of Wands energy. And they're waiting for the right opportunity. It looks like this person could be wanting to reach out and flirt with you with the Page of Wands energy, send you a passionate message. This person is looking for something long-term with the Four of Wands energy, something stable, possibly marriage for some of you. They are defensive here and they would like to have this potential uh, long-term commitment here with the Page of Pentacles energy. This person wants to overcome these challenges with the Six of Swords energy, and they're hoping if they can make this power move towards you with the Emperor card energy, um, that there can be this potential for love. So you can see that this person's like, not only do they, they have this passion for you, potential for passion and potential for long-term, but also romantic feelings. We see Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. We see uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. And we see the uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy here. At the central theme, you can see that this person's very defensive here. And they're, they're looking to the past. The, the past has really put them in a situation where they potentially got hurt. Hmm, yeah. But they want to take control of this and they do want to make a power move towards you. Thank you.
All right, my beautiful Aries, I love you guys so much. I will see you guys in another day or two with your weeklies. And also, we still have the holiday giveaway going on, so you guys still have the chance to um, get involved with that until the end of this month. So all you have to do is put blessed in love in the comments below. I love you guys so much. I hope you guys have a great rest of your next couple days, and I will see you guys soon.